Hey guys, Mad Dog here. Um, I hope you just watched the last video review we did of the Dunlop 400, Bi Bi Dunlop Biomimetic 400 Tour. This is the younger brother. It's kind of like the middle because there is also a light. We really like this. This has a lot of the same qualities, but it's a lighter weight. It's 16 by 19 string pattern, still 100 square inches, and it has that wider head as compared to the angular head or long, you know, elliptical shape that you used to from our friends at Dunlop. The weight is 10.83 ounces strum. We still have the anabolic construction, which is down in here, which is similar to that of the femur in your leg. And again, that's gonna add some stability and add some vibration dampening. This logo, again, will not be here. It'll be the flying Dunlop D that's on there when you get yours, which I hope you will. Um, it also still has the anti-friction grommets, which allow about 30% more, uh, less friction for the string and allows the string to stretch a little bit more and in increase the size of your sweet spot, giving you a little bit more comfortable, softer feel or softer ride in this. Um, the analogy I made about the 400 Tour was that this racket is a little bit like driving a car with an automatic transition, transmission having somewhat of a comfortable ride where the 400 Tour was like driving a car that had a stick shift where you're working all the time. Um, it's a very comfortable racket, easy to use. Again, 3.5 to 4.5-ish. You're gonna love this stick. Um, again, it does have all the other bells and whistles that the Biomimetics have. It has the aero skin, the gecko tack grip, et cetera, et cetera, and it, we really liked it. Um, it's just a little bit more for a lighter weight fan of a racket. You know, if you like the ra your ra rackets, sorry at a little bit lighter weight. So if uh, you're not sure about weight and balance, if you want to go middle of the road, here's a great racket to try, the four, Biomimetic 400 from Dunlop.